Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. So today I'm going to be taking guys along with me to get my hair done. So I'm super, super excited. Um, this video has been highly requested. Most of you keep asking me where I get my hair coloured and cut and how I get it cut and which colour and everything like that. But don't worry, in this video I'm going to be showing guys all of that. This is my first ever vlog, so please do bear with me. Right now I'm just here in the car waiting for my dad he's going to be giving me a lift up there um i'm super excited today all i'm going to do is retouch my roots because my roots are really dark at the moment and normally i just have like one or two shades just lighter just so that it blends in with my brown a little bit better and then i'm also going to bring up that brown color because my hair has grown so i definitely need to bring that balayage up and I'm also going to get it cut. So I'm super excited to be showing you guys that. I'm going to this Brazilian salon in London and they are called Da Silva. I normally get my hair done with Hita. She is the owner. So make sure you go there. If you do live in London or if you're like me and you don't live in London but you don't mind the distance or anything like that. Make sure you go. The salon is amazing. The people are lovely. Hita is just phenomenal. Like, she's so sweet. She's so nice. But she's so talented. Like, she's really nice. Make sure to ask for Hita. And, yeah, I will link, leave all of their links, description, everything down below. So make sure to check that out. Last year, for about five months, I was trying to achieve this um, balayage look. And... I bleached my hair, I had my hair bleached like five times or more to be honest, honestly probably more. Um, I had my hair dyed about the same amount of times. I just went crazy with my hair and my hair was looking awful. It reached the point that I literally gave up and I just dyed my hair black. Like I couldn't take it anymore. My hair was so damaged, my hair wouldn't curl. And for all you girls saying, oh I, I really wish I had healthy hair like you. My hair is not healthy at all, but I'm working on it and I'm just really happy with the way it is at the moment because comparing it to last year my hair wouldn't curl at all oh it was just horrible so I went to the silver and oh my god she literally I don't know my hair was falling it was ugly it was horrible by the time I left the salon my hair was so stunning like I was like oh is this even my hair? Like, I was so utterly surprised. So, I filmed a whole intro. Now I'm just sitting here bored. I think my dad forgot that I'm in the car waiting for him. I think he's totally forgot. Because... I've been sitting here for a while. Daddy! <laughs> he always forgets about me. He says he's going to have a cup of tea. And then... I go inside and he's just on the computer, chilling. And I'm like, Dad, you know I'm waiting for you, right? And he's like, oh, are you? I was waiting for you. What? Ugh. Anyways, I'm going to go inside and check what he's doing. Be right back. Okay, so the salon is literally a five minute walk from Westfield Shopping Centre. It's located in Shepherd's Bush. I will leave all of their information down in the description box below. And as you can see, the salon is just really cozy and cute. And everyone that works there is just super, super nice. Um, so a quick tip for when you're getting your hair done is always show a stylist a photo of the hair you wish to achieve. As you can see, I'm just telling Hita what I want because she has already done my hair before and all she's doing is basically retouching. But always make sure to show the stylist a photo and give them a few options because unfortunately when it comes to hair, what we want to achieve isn't always possible. I have to do all her hair again. This, this I'm gonna move up. And then after I'm gonna to do toner and um, I'm gonna trim because otherwise she's not gonna get the nice curls we have. And then she can use her hair straight and curl as well. 
Okay, so I'm gonna quickly run through what Hita did to my hair. I'm not an expert, but I'm going to try to explain what she did in the best possible way that I can. So basically there are different techniques and methods of doing an ombre or balayage. It really does depend on your stylist or colorist. But Hita basically sections my hair and then back combs and then adds the bleach. I asked Hita to use the same technique as she used last time, except this time make it a shade or two lighter just because I wanted a bit of a change. Can we take a second to appreciate how beautiful Junior's hair is? Literally hair goals right there. <laughs> and by the way, he is shaving his hair for charity, which is actually really, really awesome. I'm going to find out further information, so hopefully we can help him raise money for charity. And he is also an amazing stylist. He did an ombre on my mom's hair and it turned out absolutely stunning. <laughs> while Hita started off by washing the bottom section of my hair because that bit was done and the top wasn't done yet so she let me have a quick lunch break and by the way this food doesn't look spectacular but it actually tasted really really good and then once she was done washing my hair she added the toner now I can sit here and tell you exactly which toner she used but the reality of it is we all have different hair colors and different hair types so it's better that you show your stylist the color or cut or whatever you wish to achieve and let him figure out what he needs to do to get you to that stage just because what works for me may not work for you and I don't want anyone to be disappointed Now, whenever I go to the salon, I always have a treatment done. Hita has amazing treatments and she also has the Olaplex, which I know is really, really popular. But I had a different treatment done and this is the exact same treatment that I had done last time, which absolutely saved my hair. And I'm just sitting here underneath this steamer, I'm gonna say. And I think this basically just activates the hair mask but it's really nice and warm and I absolutely love it. <laughs> My mom decided to get an ombre done as well. She literally came to film this video for me but gave up after 10 minutes. Thank God for Jay the manager who was kind enough to film this video for me. Um, next is getting my hair cut. The cut I have really complements my curls. I basically have my hair cut straight across, almost like a blunt cut to make my hair appear thicker. Then I have it shaped around my face and then I have layers added in. Here Heater is showing you guys what not to get done. Basically a lot of stylists in the past would literally use scissors and push it down the front of my hair and I would literally feel my hair breaking. I don't know if you guys know what I mean but make sure that your stylist is cutting rather than pushing the scissors down. And I also don't get my hair feathered just because I want my hair to look as thick as possible. Mom, you should be filming me. I shouldn't really be filming you. Come on. Come on. But anyways, now I'm getting my Brazilian blow dry. If you guys haven't had one, please go to a Brazilian salon and get yourself a Brazilian blow dry. It will last you literally up to a week and a half. It's honestly amazing. And you will see in a bit that I will start to squint just because I want to see the hair color and without my glasses, I can't see shizzle. So yeah.
I'm not saying anything because I can't see anything, but wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, Rita, vamos escupar. A primeira vez ficou bonito, mas dessa vez ficou melhor. Nossa! Que lindo! Wow! So as you can see, I'm completely blown away. The hair looks absolutely beautiful and this is the exact colour that I wanted. So I would really like to thank everyone at the salon, especially Hita, for doing such a great job and completely transforming my hair. And also to Jay for being kind enough to film this video for me. I will leave the salon's details down in the description box below. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below what you guys want to see next and until next time take care beijos